really interested in my lab in understanding disease and potentially making access to new medicines a little bit easier. We're hoping that by increasing the efficiency of an angioselective addition of trifluoromethylation, we can increase the efficiency of pharmaceutical development um, and hopefully bring down costs and make a wider variety of drugs more easily available. My goal for the summer is to design a peptoid that can be used as a biological probe for other researchers to investigate the development of cancer and Alzheimer's disease. Okay, so what we do is it helps to address a really pressing biomedical need. I'm interested in like kind of global public health and really using the tools that I've learned like within my like chemistry and bio classes to try to really work on a real world problem um, and to try to like, find just new alternatives and new ways to solve global health crises. I was really interested in chemical biology, just using chemistry as a tool to impact um, life positively. And then for me, I actually became interested when I actually, my first fancy year summer, I spent time shadowing doctors. So I actually got to see literal tissues of like cancer and I think that hit home to me very hard. And so I wanted to kind of participate in a lab that's kind of developing therapeutics or treatment methods to kind of treat these diseases. And I will start. Okay. <laughs> okay. So the organism we work with in the McBride lab is Candida albicans. And Candida is the most common human fungal pathogen, and it can infect the internal organs and bloodstream of immunocompromised patients, leading to up to 50% mortality in these more serious cases. In biology classes, we learn over and over about like DNA, mRNA, and like like we're always like taught that, and we never get to really investigate it and find answers on our own. I've just found that I'm really interested in how cells work at the molecular level and looking at different mechanisms like this. Um, and the fact that we don't know so much 